it's time then for one final race in this year's Formula One World Championship. 2010 saw four drivers in contention for the title coming into this race, with Sebastian Vettel prevailing to become the youngest world champion to date. Is there one last sting in the tail awaiting us today? Well, it's time to find out here at the Abu Dhabi Grand Prix. The drivers will be racing here at the Yas Marina circuit through 16 corners and a lap distance of around 3.28 miles. There are a few opportunities to pass with long straights and DRS zones in two places. So plenty of close racing, then plenty of speed and plenty of drama to be found in the laps ahead. Off the back of a fantastic qualifying session, it's time to see how our starting grid looks like for today's race. What a qualifying yesterday for George Russell. He'll start today's race from pole position. And Lewis Hamilton completes the front row. Looking at the rest of today's grid, we have Verstappen, Oscar Piastri, Fernando Alonso, Gasly, Sainz, Albon, Norris, the owner driver, Leclerc, Stroll, Bottas, Ocon, Joe, Sonoda, De Vries, Drogovic, Liam Lawson, Sargent, Theo Porcher, and Kevin Magnussen fills the last spot on the grid. With preparations almost complete, let's head down to the track.
the underbodies incurred some slight damage, but nothing too serious at the moment, just be careful. Okay, good work, great pass. Verstappen behind you now. Okay, the gap is less than a second. They're on fresh softs. Their tyres are three laps old. We think they've got one more stop. The last lap time was a 126.4. Okay, the underbody's taken some damage. You might start to notice it soon. Up to speed now, let's get some heat into those tyres. Gap to your teammate behind is 13.9 seconds. They're on fresh mediums, they're currently 21st. Tires. Car behind, running hard tires. Nice work, 
checkmate. That brings you up a place. Just five laps of fuel remaining. from you the whole team is really proud of you so thank you for a fantastic effort see you back in the pit lane and with that another year of formula one draws to a close and a new world drivers champion is declared another entry added to that prestigious list of the sport's most incredible drivers victory today then but bittersweet emotions i'm sure as the championship slips through their fingers even so, what a fantastic final. The faces on our top three look so incredibly happy as they make their way up to the podium. A much-deserved victory and a brilliant performance from them all. And this also means there's no catching our leader anymore. And we crown a new World Drivers' Champion. And now let's take a look at the driver's standings. So, Anthony Davidson, who would you rank as your driver of the day? The Constructors' Championship may be a foregone conclusion at the moment, but regardless, let's look at the standings. It's another clear win for Mercedes as they manage to secure the Constructors' title. An incredible performance for the whole team. Meanwhile, AlphaTauri's strong weekend allows them to continue their march up the table.